So I'm looking at this picture of San Francisco that Microsoft put onto my desktop. And what if I really wanted to know the exact type of paint that's being used here on this building? Well, to do that, I can go to the Microsoft store and download this excellent Power Toys app from Microsoft. The Power Toys app has a bunch of utilities that you can turn on and off at will. For this task, what we need is Color Picker. So the Color Picker module is activated with Windows Shift C. Let's try that. I'm going to minimize all this. Windows Shift C. So now when I move the mouse around, I've got a little value following my mouse and the color. Okay. So let's aim at the pink right here. Ah, there you go. So what that value is, is a hex value. It actually specifically targets that color. So if I left click it, you'll notice I have the hex value here and I have the red, green, blue value, the RGB value and the HSL value. So that's what appears by default. And I can always press pick again, choose another color release and have a new value here. I can also go back into my history. So I can select this pink again and then copy that and stick it into a web page somewhere in CSS, actually use the value to create something just like I can use it in Photoshop, for example. Now, if we click on the little cog here, and close this, you'll see that there's a bunch of settings. You can change the shortcut. You can also change the activation behavior. So in this case, you pick a color and then the editor opens, but there's other options here. So open the editor immediately or only pick a color. And then there's different color formats. Now, the one I want to see personally is hex. And then I can choose to show a color name, which is kind of like a friendly color name. We'll look at that in a bit. And I can activate other color formats here. So I can turn on, let's say, end call. Then we'll minimize this and do Windows Shift C. And then you can see here, light orange, uh, lavender, all that. Now, the benefit about this is that you can pick up any color you see in Windows anywhere. So I can hover down here and get the yellow of the folder and it works. This isn't a plugin that lives in a browser, for example, which I've used in the past and it was useful. This is anything, anything you see. So I thought that was great and I wanted you guys to know. Enjoy.